Photoshop Extended, there's a number of new 3D options that you can use. And you can use them with custom shapes. And I'm just going to show you one of them. Just going to go to the custom shape tool, select a custom shape. These are graphic extras. Try it, radial shapes, but you could, of course, use any shape such as the ones here. Load your own via the load and replace command. Going to select one of those designs. Select that one. And I'm going to use the shape layer option, shape layers. So I'm just going to draw that out. Then go to the 3D. This is extended, Photoshop extended. Repousse, however you pronounce that. Maybe I'm pronouncing that slightly wrong. But uh, anyway, use that. A layer mask. Yes. And as soon as you do that, it takes a few seconds for it to uh, turn it into a 3D design. It does. And move that away. And you can then rotate the design. You can apply various presets. There's a selection of presets here. Click that preset. We'll use that one. Also, you can change the materials. You can change the extrude depth. I'm just going to quickly modify that. You can see that. And you can click OK at this point. Of course, you can change all sides of things, such as the lighting. But uh, I'm just going to click OK. And this is still a layer, so you could you can modify it. Also, you can apply layer styles at this point as well. So you can say drop shadow. Actually add a drop shadow to the 3D effect. And so on and so on. Stroke. So on. Click OK. Great, many different designs. Actually, that creates a very uh, sort of comic book uh, design in seconds. 3D design. 